Some of the reports that we get said that you left Unity Fountain. Now, you say that you left Unity Fountain because some of your supporters were in Wuse Market. Yes. Why didn't the supporters in Wuse Market come to the Unity Fountain? Because they wanted us to come and talk to others there, you know, who can join us in the 100 days for tomorrow, for today. That's today. Yeah, you know. So, there, you know, this is not the first time our group is going to be attacked. We attacked on Tuesday. Where, uh, you know, they wanted to attack us again on Friday last week. You know, but it took the prevention of some of the police people and the SSS people who were at the Unity Fountain. Mm. And we are not surprised by these attacks. Mm. We will not be discouraged by these attacks because many people have opined that, you know, this is what makes people lose confidence and faith in the country. Mm. But we will not be discouraged by these attacks. Let's get this clear. So you went to the Wuse Market. Now, there were reports that when you got to Wuse Market, some of the traders, I mean, at the gate, the security man was very apprehensive and refused to let you in. Was that true? Yes, there was a man who, his name is Musa. He was putting on a white, you know, uh, a dress and is in charge of the tax force in the market. You know, uh, funny enough, we later saw him with those people that came to attack us. You know, and, um, you know, we, in the report that we made at the police station, we also indicated that, that where we're trying to come into the market, you know, people were very happy when they saw us. You know, we had finished. We had finished talking to people, speaking to people, and we were about leaving when he brought, they brought those thugs, you know, in to attack us.